There's a meeting tonight in Warwick about how to go forward with the building of those two new high schools. That's after they've learned it may cost a lot more money than voters originally approved. Lauren Brill talked to the chairman of the school committee ahead of tonight's meeting, and Lauren joins us now live. Lauren. Yeah, Michael, Chairman Sean Galligan tells me that tonight they will update the public on the progress of building these two new high schools, but they will not come to a decision on how to bring this cost down. Now, although construction has not started, a lot of progress has been made. Galligan says they're currently in the schematic design phase, hoping to break ground in March 2025. Now, the concern here is that the price tag to build the two new schools in Warwick is more than what voters originally approved back in 2020. 2022. School officials say the cost is now nearly $40 million more than the $350 million bond. 12 News previously reported that $50 million in cuts have already been made, and the school committee vice chair, Leah Hazelwood, suggested bringing this project back to voters for a referendum. But the chairman tells me they're still looking at a number of options. The numbers are greater than $350 million because three years have passed and the market, you know, for materials has gone through the roof. Inflation with the economy, uh, that's, that's what's hitting us the most on this. Now, this meeting is about to begin at 630. There's also a public comment period where members of the community can come and voice their concerns and opinions on this project. We'll continue to keep you updated. Live in Warwick, Lauren Brill, 12 News.